Here we go. All right. Oh, my necky. All right. <clears throat> Hi, everyone, and welcome to TWF Dynamite or Might. I, Mike Lane, Tony Schiavati, and Taz here. And today on Dynamite or Might, we're going to have a good show here today. We're going to have Corey Graves doing backroom speaking here today, <clears throat> Mike Lane says. That's right, Tony Schiavelli said, Mike Lane. We're going to have a good a good show here today on Dynamite or Might. And hopefully it's going to be a good match. Well, I can tell you one thing, Mike and Tony, right now, Taz says. I don't know if we're going to have a good show here today on Dynamite or Might. But I know that it's going to be a good show. I know that much. But then again, I don't really know that much to begin with. But I'm just saying, Taz says, I just hope it's going to be a good day. That's all. <clears throat> well, sorry for that burp, Mike, uh, Mike Lane said, if you heard it or not. All right. All right, Otis Draws, Nick says. It's Tom. <coughs> sorry for that cough again. Well... No, we already... And now put them back up here. Well, all right, shit. Well, all right, so... Here it comes. All right, Miko Sanatino said, I know I, I know that I haven't been seen on the show as many times that I should be on the show. But I know today that I'm going to get... You know, that I'm going to get even on someone... That I should be on a show. You see, I was a by, you know, by mistake. Well, I want to tell you one thing. I think I should be on a show. And the way I look at it is, is that I think I should, you know, stand up to evildoers. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna, yeah, you're, that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, is it Miko Sanatini, Above the Law, or also known as Miko Above the Law. That film has two unlike names. You see, I'm gonna tell you right now, Drew McIntyre says, I'm not frightened of you. And I also got someone who's also willing to help me beat you up. At the end of the day, He's not frightened of you either. Well, I never said anyone should be frightened of me. You see, you're putting words in my mouth because I never said that. All right? See, you're putting words in my mouth because at the end of the day, that never came out of my mouth. You know... Shit. Because that never came out of my mouth. So now you're putting words in my mouth. What I did say was I was going to bring the fight to any evildoer or wrongdoer. And Drew McIntyre, I believe that now you would be an evildoer or a wrongdoer now because you shifted heel. And I bloody have someone that says they're going to help me kick your bloody rear. Ha ha, what are you going to do now? Yeah, what are you going to do now, Adam Cole says, when me and Drew McIntyre beat the shit out of you, Miko Sanatino. You're a law keeper with no backup. And I'll tell you what right now. You're looking at the our former ROH heavyweight fighter, WWE NXT heavyweight fighter, WWE NXT nor Vinlander fighter. And you're looking at the two-time WWE heavyweight fighter, one-time WWE Ender Landbody fighter, one-time WWE NXT heavyweight fighter, TNA W heavyweight fighter, EPW heavyweight fighter, two-time WWE Raw tag team fighter. Yeah, I know all the shit you both did in WWE and outside of WWE. 
But you see, Adam Cole, you didn't do nothing outside of WWE. Oh yeah, you may have been, yeah, you really didn't. You're going to talk about, you didn't do nothing in the NWA or MLW. You did shit in WWE, yeah, in ROH before WWE. But you went to AEW, where's your winnings at? Nothing. At least you, Drew McIntyre, did some things in WWE and also outside of WWE. But mostly inside WWE. But if you think that I'm going to be frightened of the two of you, you can think again because that's not happening. Oh, I'm sorry you feel that way. Oh! And Drew McIntyre just knocked down Miko Santino, Tini, and just gave him the Claymore kick, whatever the English word for that would be. And Adam Cole just gave him his move too. Ah, we we so great, aren't we? Ha 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 ha. And now we have the first fight lord coming out to stop the beatdown from happening. Mike Lane says, that's right, Tony Schiavone said, we got a two-disc fight keeper in the ring, too. But you know, Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole, one's in WWE and one's in AEW, but they both like being heels, so they like to overlook that. And we can only hope that someone in the in the TWF upper leadership or someone in the TWF oversight team or matchmaking team or leadership team is going to do something about Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole's deed here today on Dynamite or Mike. Hey Mike, Tony, I love Drew McIntyre. I always fought when Drew McIntyre was a heel and his first run in WWE when he was a heel when he was in TNAW and also when he was kind of a heel when he was an EPW, when he was a heel in his two diff run in WWE before he became good, before becoming a heel again. And Adam Cole, I he was always a heel in MLW and NWA and ROH and WWE and AEW. He was never good in any of those ones, Taz says. But I know one thing, Miko Senatino or Senatini or wherever you go by saying that Latinist or it Italish kin name, you know, he gonna get beat up now. You know what? Fuck this. Your rears are mine, Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole. I'm calling you out for a match now. Well, Taz says we're going to see if we're going to get that match or not. I understand Miko Sanatini is going to run the golf, going to run the group, and run the row now. And if he can beat past Adam Cole or Drew McIntyre, it's going to be good. But sadly, it's a tag team match, Mike Lane said. More of a handicap match. The handicap is you got that you don't have anyone to tag in. That is the handicap, Tony Schiavone said. That's why they called them handicap tag team matches, Tony Schiavone said. Yeah, Taz says, and that's good because both, both Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole can tag in and out. Miko Sanatini has no one to tag in. Miko Sanatini just took out Drew McIntyre. He just knocked out Adam Cole out of the ring. Nico Sanatini thinks he's got everyone to run the lead. Oh, Drew McIntyre just took him down with the Claymark kick. And the, the upcoming shot, DDT, whatever those free runes stand for. And I know that's nothing to do with DDP wrestling. With DDTPW. Mike Lane said, no, probably does not. Tony Schiavone said, Miko Sanatini is not doing very well against Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole, Tony Schiavone says. No, he's not, Taz says, and the fight lord, the match keeper, whatever you want to say it, he should have been in the ring, but he's now he is now, Taz said. One, two, three. Ding, ding, ding. Here is your winners. 
Drew McIntyre, and Adam Cole. Well, we can tell you one thing, Tony Schiavone says, tell you one thing, Mike Lane says, that somehow Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole got some bond. And why they chose to take it out on or bully or pick on Miko Santini is beyond my in, 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 you know, side of my in thought, in what, input, in wise, no, insight. Yeah, insight, Mike Lane says. Well, your guess is good of mine why Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole have crafted or made this bond. And your insight is that your guess is good as mine about why they took it out on Miko Sanatini. I don't know, Taz says, but I do know that's what bullies have always done over the years. They've always gone after and picked on the small and the weak. Those who they believe could not fight back or could not stand up to them. You know, I don't know why. I know Taz says that I was guilty of doing that when I was in ICCW and ECW, uh, ICCW and NJPW and ECW and WWF and WWE and TNAW, IW and AEW. Yeah. Well, we're going to take it away now to Corey Graves. Thank you, Mike Lane and Tony Schiavati. I'm going to be talking with Miko, talking with Drew McIntyre and Corey Gray. I'm going to be talking with Miko Sanatini today. Miko Sanatini, it seems that your thin things didn't quite go the way you want them to go. Oh no, Corey Graves. It didn't go very well at all. I get bullied by Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole. I mean a WWE wrestler, an AEW wrestler. I mean at least Drew McIntyre has done a lot more both outside and in WWE than Adam Cole has ever done. You know? But those two teaming up together, making some kind of bond to go after me, thinking that I'm weak, thinking that I can't stand up to them or I can't fight back against them, they're wrong. And I don't know what Drew McIntyre's bind is. I don't know what Adam Cole's bind is. They started something, I'm going to end it. Well, we all do know when we watched the film Above the Law or Miko Above the Law, you did some things in that film that a lot of folks would say would be sinful and unlawful, becoming of a law keeper, formerly a fight, a formerly a, fa a, a, a fighting arm fighter. Yeah, I did a lot of things in that film, above the law, Miko above the law, that I'm not really happy I did. And Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole are going to be lucky that it was not that film. Because if it was, they would not be, they would not be living right now. Well, I don't know why Drew McIntyre and Adam Cole did what they did, but I only hope that you somehow get even with them for the wrongs that they did to you. Well, I will. Well, that's my talk with Miko Sanatini. Back to you, Mike Lane and Tony Schiavati. Thank you, Corey Graves, for talking with Miko Sanatini here today on Dynamite or Mike. And it's all the time we got here for Dynamite or Might. I, Mike Lane, Tony Schiavati, and Taz. We hope you like Dynamite or Might. And we'll see you tomorrow for Impact or Hit.